Spoiler alert! Spoiler alert! The following video will contain spoilers from The Flash Season 5 premiere episode titled Nora. So if you don't want anything ruined for you or spoiled, stop watching now. Also, this video will contain language of a frank and explicit nature. Viewer discretion is advised. If you cannot handle four-letter words, stop watching now. For everybody else, hi guys, welcome to my many faces, I'm Dave. Darker than Damien, more savage than Vandal, and this is the Flash Roast. Now, it has been a while since I've done one of these, and to be honest, uh, it's good to be back, but unfortunately I'm not going to be able to do it as much as I used to do it in the past. See, I know I used to do it like once a week, which I love to do, but to be honest, one, my overall anger with the Arrowverse has gone down quite a bit. I mean, you know, uh, Mark is getting the hell out of there for a while now. He's got a new showrunner. I'm anxious to see where she goes with it. And I understand that the entire Arrowverse is pretty much just an Elseworld. So, it's all based on the comic stuff. Some of the stuff's similar. Other stuff is really fucking different. Okay, I get that. But also, yeah, I'm finding out more and more about my blood pressure and my health. Mostly, the more I get angry, the more I let my blood pressure get higher, the more detrimental it will be to my health. And considering I was just in the hospital last fucking month, I'm not in any anxious hurry to go back there, okay? So, I may not be doing as many roasts in the future as I used to. However, <laughs> don't, no, 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 don't get pissy. Don't get pissy. No, no, no. Shh, 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 it's okay. I would be a remiss motherfucker if I did not point out the shit that went down in the episode for Nora. Now, we find out a few things. Now, we know that, that Nora is their daughter from the future. However, let's look at some of the shit that they pulled here. Basically, she comes from 30 years of the future. Which makes sense, you know, time-wise, you know, I should say. But it's just a little shit. You know, I mean, she name drops like a goddamn TMZ paparazzo, dude. I mean, she's a little shit here. Like, they go to Jitters, and she talks about, oh, Lightning Lad's bolt, uh, symbol, symbol was nowhere near as cool as this, as Dad's, you know, it, Lightning Lad. Lightning Lad. Originally one of the founding members of the fucking Legion of Superheroes. Only problem is, the Legion that we know of was started by Monel on Earth 38, a thousand years in the fucking future. So how does she know anything about him? Yeah, I'm not sure that's just going to be covered in the fucking Flash Museum here, are you? You know, I, I don't know. It's just. The way she talked about it is like we got another legionnaire possibly in her future, which means that Lightning Lad comes from Earth and not an alien. What the fuck, dude? I just look. There's some cool shit that they threw in a blender, like Shway from Batman Beyond. I love that theme song. Oh, come on! Oh, it's just fire. But you know, a little shit like Ryan Choi. Ended up making the Flash ring with the costume in it. Now, Ryan Choi, in the comics, was the second person to take up the mantle of the Atom uh, after the predecessor being Ray Palmer. Now, this brings up an interesting question. When, a, when Flash lost his power and was fighting a freaking dude with super strength, the connection to Fei Fei managed to get some extra Dwarf Star alloy to coat the inside of the frickin' flash suit so if he could take a couple of hits he wouldn't be killed. Now, this bears a very quickly question. Ray Palmer, he's the nicest guy in the Arrowverse. Can we chalk that up? Yeah. Good guy, nice guy, very friendly, very chummy. You're telling me that his predecessor has to do the fucking flash ring when it's been hinted at for years and the original Adam that shrinks can't do Homeboy a solid? Diggle, please! 
That's just, no, no. That, that's some fucked up shit right there. What's wrong with this? Ray, get your ass off the wave rider. Make the ring for your boy, okay? Holler at your boy. But it's also this little stuff like uh, Ralph finally realizing the whole depths about time travel and interdimensional travel. And they dropped a cute little shit that is like, well, it's a good thing you didn't go back in time to save me. Otherwise, you might create a world where I died. Kind of like the first version of season one when he and several other heroes got name dropped and kind of fucking killed. So, yeah, with that one little bit, they kind of fixed continuity hiccups there. Because, right, because back when Al Rothstein showed up in season two, was it? Yeah, I mean, yeah, like, like that doesn't get a fucking bother anybody here. What the hell, Ed? <sighs> See, I gotta, I gotta stay tranquilized. I can't get too fucking upset. But yeah, Adam Smasher was one of the fucking names that they talked about on there. But they take him out. No, they just brought him back, and people were like, ah, 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 no. Cause, but now, I'm just pissed off because if Jenny Lynn is dropping names for members of the Legion. That means one of two things. Well, actually, one of three things. One, the Flash Museum gives her information about the Legion of Superheroes, and that's where she got it from. Two, she, you know, the, the worlds end up getting merged, so she ends up finding everything out about Supergirl and the aliens and shit like that. Or three, <laughs> Lightning Lad is just another poor motherfucker who gets powers and takes over sometime after the Justice League. I'm not too crazy about that, but I just... Some of the Legionnaires, sure, I can see from Earth. I mean, Chuck Tane, Bouncing Boy, he was originally from Earth. Karate Kid, from Earth. Uh, Drake Burroughs, a.k.a. Wildfire, he was from Earth. All this shit could happen. Lightning Lad originally wasn't. Neither was his brother and sister, Lightning Lord and Lightning Lass, who eventually turned into Light Lass. So, I don't know, man. It's just, uh, uh, but just, there's been a few Earthers, but I'm just, are they going to change shit to where there's aliens now? Are they going to be in sooner? What the fuck is it? It's just, it's just, the whole Lightning Lad thing is driving me fucking bonkers, man. It's like, they're just, I, I know the whole Arrowverse is a goddamn Elseworld. But when they do shit like that, it's like they just, they're taking names from the DC Universe and they, they, they drop it into a fucking blender and they make a goddamn multiverse smoothie. Ah! 